Hello guys, welcome to the fourth Matplotlib tutorial. Today we'll talk about colors and markers. Now I'm sure you are already familiar with the plot you see on the left hand side. This is the same plot that we have been working in our previous tutorial. If you haven't watched those tutorials, I would highly recommend finishing those tutorials before you start here. Now on the right hand side, you will see a similar graph but with different colors and some markers. Those markers help identifying the data points in our plot. So today we will learn how to change the color of a plot and add markers to our plot for better visualization. Let's go back to our previous example. Now if we run the previous code then we can see a familiar blue color plot that we have been working with in our last three tutorials. Now let's go ahead and change the color of this plot. To change the color of this plot, let's go back to the matplotlib tutorial and here we can see the various color abbreviations that matplotlib supports. So basically for blue we can use the character B. Actually we can also use the name blue itself but why write so much when uh, it can be accomplished by just using one character, right? So these are the abbreviations and these are the color names. So go ahead, uh, once the tutor is, uh, tutorial is finished, go ahead and practice these colors on your plots and see what uh, suits best to your plot. So now we have to change it to red. So I can pass in a parameter called color and I will pass in the character R. So let's go ahead and run this. So now we can see our plot has changed to the red color. Let's go ahead and add some markers. Now if we go back to our matplotlib tutorial here, we can see that matplotlib has various string characters defined for, uh, for markers. So basically there is a point marker here, there is a pixel marker, circle marker, triangle down marker. So we are going to use the circle marker basically. So here I can pass in another parameter called the marker and then I am going to pass in small o which is basically the character uh, denotion of circle marker. Now when I go ahead and run this you can see that we have markers here in our plot and these markers are actually better because they help visualizing the data in a much better way. right? So this is how you basically change the color and add markers to your plots in matplotlib. Now there is one uh, more extra thing it is called the uh, marker color basically. So basically if, uh, uh, to have even better visualization we can change the color of the marker. That can be achieved by using the parameter called marker face color and that is equal to let's say green right. I mean we don't need a pretty picture right now we just want to see different ways of uh, using colors in our plots. So when I run this you can see that the marker color has changed now. So sometimes when you have huge sets of data uh, using such parameters can help you visualize your data in a much more efficient way. So thank you guys. I'll see you in the next tutorial.